Hi, I'm Adam Wyatt from Trinity Restaurant in Clapham. Today I'm going to cure you some salmon using mould and sea salt to make the dish extraordinary. I love smoked salmon at Christmas. I think it's fantastic. But this is a great way to cure your own salmon for Christmas Day, but adding those festive ingredients to it to make it really seasonal as well. Curing salmon is not difficult. It's one of those things where you just need really good quality salmon. This is farm salmon from Noctua. You need really good quality sugar. We're using soft demerara sugar and you need great quality salt. And I love molten sea salt. What I've done here is used 50% smoked molten salt and 50% normal molten salt. So we get that bit of earthiness going through it as well. It's a very simple principle. The fish weighs a kilo. So that's a kilo piece of salmon fillet. So we need 50% of the weight in fish divided by sugar and salt equally. So that's a kilo. This is 250 grams of, sorry, 125 grams of salt. And this is 125 grams of sugar. Pop those together. Very simple to do. I'm gonna add some, it would be clementine, but these are lovely leafy oranges. So I'm gonna add the zest from some orange and the juice as well. And I'm gonna add some crushed black peppercorns just to give it a little bit of heat. And then we're gonna add some gin as well. I think the gin really helps. It really sort of cures the fish and gives it that, the botanicals from the gin really help. So that, and then the juice of the orange as well. Squeeze that in too. That acid's gonna help to cure as well. And all you need to do is spread this mix over the fish and leave it in the fridge, wrapped up for 24 hours. After 24 hours, turn it over and leave it for another 24 hours. So in total, it's 48 hours in the fridge. Once it's all mixed up together, like that. There we go. After 48 hours, all you need to do is take the salmon out of the fridge, rinse it under cold water, and then just pat it dry. In with my gin. It's about 500 mils, uh, 50 mils for a kilo. That's just enough to flavor. You can smell the orange and the gin and the smoke salt together. Really fantastic. And what you do is spread that across the tray on the bottom of the tray like that. Place your salmon on. And I've just scored the underneath of the salmon the skin to make sure that it can penetrate through into the flesh as well. So that's the lovely salmon. I've just added that mix underneath and I've patted it down on top. I'm gonna to wrap that in some cling film, pop it in the fridge. After 24 hours, I'm gonna turn the whole thing over so the salmon flesh is face down. And then after another 24 hours, I'm gonna take it out of the fridge, rinse it very gently under cold water and then pat it dry and leave it to set for about two hours before I slice it very thinly and probably serve that with some lovely cucumber. So that's my beautiful cured salmon for Christmas Day using mold and sea salt and wishing you all a happy Christmas.